Luck ran out as far as Indianapolis and Drew Luck. They just couldn't get it done. Patrick Mahomes continues to even impress me. But yesterday it was just the Chiefs, a little ground and pound, strong defense. They advanced. So your thoughts about that, Joshua Taylor, of course. 93.7 The Fan, KDK TV2. Um, I was not as surprised to see Kansas City do a lot on the ground. They got a lot of speed. They got guys that can actually do things like that with the ball. So it didn't really surprise me that much. Patrick Mahomes it kind of just added another chapter to the legend, right? Um, like I said, not really surprised at what they did. I'm more probably disappointed in how the Colts performed. I thought they'd be a lot better than that. They were actually one of the teams that I thought was hotter going into the playoffs. I was actually even entertaining the thought of a Colts and Chargers AFC Championship game. I felt really strongly about that, so I was really disappointed. When the only touchdown you score in the first half is off a block punt, things probably aren't going well for you. So, yeah, probably not as surprised with Kansas City. We know they can put up points. They've been doing that all season long, but I thought the Colts would give a much better effort and they just didn't do it. All right, how about the one-two punch of the Rams? Everybody thinks about Jared Goff slinging the football, which he can do, but yesterday, it was Anderson and Gurley, 123 to 115 respectively. They get by the Cowboys, who gave them a game, and they will advance to the NFC Championship game. Todd Gurley getting injured earlier in the season kind of became a blessing in disguise for the Rams because it forced them to look at other options in the backfield. So they find a guy like C.J. Anderson, and he becomes more of a focal point as they rest Todd Gurley. Then Todd Gurley gets back, and you're like, wait a minute. We can play with both of these guys and do things. And what did they do? They combined for 238 yards and three touchdowns yesterday against the Cowboys. And that was a team you needed to run the ball well against because the Cowboys themselves are a team that are built to run the football. And CQ Elliott is a high-volume carry guy. That offensive line is one of the best in the game. So to be able to match that team ground and ground and actually outrush them and do as well as they did, really impressive. Really like what the Rams are doing right now. Coons Market Black and Gold Sunday show today at 11. More on the NFL then. We're going to come back preview today's games next. Stay with us.